Hey guys, see Max signing and hope you guys are having a great day. Now as we're getting very very close to transfer deadline day, I thought I might as well bring you a video showing you some cheap and overpowered players you guys can get. Now I'm gonna tell you right now, you're gonna be seeing players that haven't really been used that much in FIFA, but because of a position change, people are gonna be abusing these players. And some of the players you're gonna be seeing in this video are players you definitely don't wanna come up against in a game online. Anyway, if you're looking to watch another transfer video by me, I have a link down in the description to another video I did. It was actually a squad builder where I went into a game. So after you've done watching this you can maybe give that a watch nevertheless i actually went out and did some research for you guys looking for new transfers sweaty transfers overpowered transfers and most importantly cheap transfer players and i'm not gonna lie guys i found a lot and basically what i'm gonna be doing in this video is be showing you guys as many of them as i can in the hopes that you go try them out and maybe tell me how they play down in the comment section below as always if you do go on to enjoy this video a like rating is very much appreciated and with that said let's actually get into this Starting us off as the goalkeeper, we have Valdez, and before I move on, I know I'm doing this on concept squads, but I didn't want to go out and buy all of the players, mainly because some of them are actually extinct on the market, as you're going to find out very soon. But anyways, getting sidetracked, we have Valdez. Most of you will be happy to know that he's now transferred from Manchester United, so you will no longer be getting that De Gea troll in your open packs. Bruh. And to be fair to him, he is actually a good card, and he's a goalkeeper you can use if you're building Spanish teams. Moving on to the back four, I know some players are out of position, but I want to fit in as many players as I can for you guys. We have Zuniga starting us off. He went from Napoli to Bologna, if I'm correct. I never actually knew he made this move, but then again, he's still in the Serie so that's good. And he is a pretty OP player as well as cheap on the games I had to throw him in. Next to him, we have this guy, Jeffrey. My name is Jeff. You're not even going to try to pronounce his second name. Pretty OP looking centre back card. He's moved from the Dutch league, so that's the Eredivisie league, to the Bundesliga. And at the moment, I currently do a series called the Ultimate Squad. In that, I have a German league side at the moment, so you probably be seeing him in that very soon next team we have Coker. he's probably one of the better cheap transfers which is why i put him in this team pretty decent for a defender in the bpl and in the right back position we have a right midfield player and it's this guy carlos sanchez a lot of you guys probably haven't heard of him plays in the league of Bunkuma mx he's pretty op used him in a video and if you're interested in watching that i'll link that down in the description as well moving up the team of el shirari at sue townsend and a turbo starting us off with a turbo here is a transfer who's gone from the syria to the BPL used to play a Rome and I'm pretty sure you can't argue with me when I say this guy is OP. Next Townsend, a really underused player this FIFA's moved from Tottenham to Newcastle. He's a really good and really cheap player nevertheless and yeah that's why I've thrown him into the team. Atsu this month alone has had a position change as well as two transfers. He was once a left winger ball mouth, moved to Chelsea as a centre mid and from Chelsea I think we loaned him out to Malaga and he's still a centre midfield card. Nevertheless he's got 92 pace, 80 dribbling and in that position that is pretty insane. Now to finish off this little section we have El Shirari now a lot of you guys will probably be happy he's back in the Serie A now at Roma and in my opinion he's always been a really good player I mean four star skills four star week for always good to see in a player and that's why he's made it into this team now to finish off this 11 we have a player you guys all know and that's Dumbia who transferred from CSK back to Roma OP as we all know but we have a new dude over here and his name is Gakpe now a lot of you guys are probably thinking he's not new I know he's not a new player he's been in the game but he's been given a position change and he's now a striker a lot more people are gonna start abusing this guy to tell you the truth i'm probably gonna use him a bit as well anyways this is a little squad i wanted to put together showing you guys some players you can try out now don't worry i'm not gonna leave you there guys there's more as you can see here on the bench we have players like amrabat i think this guy's name is pronounced be of you if i kill that name i apologize i'm about 88 pace 84 dribbling which is just op this dude 89 pace 80 dribbling he was op in the league one and he's now in the league of bvva so imagine what kind of teams you guys can build next thing we have tell on that this dude is currently extinct in the market but if you keep searching for him you could possibly get him he will be getting another card change going from barcelona to fiorentina so this card will become very rare with how the market is at the moment this guy's more so overpowered than cheap mainly because like i said he's extinct next thing we have a barber now this guy's gonna dramatically drop in price he's now in the liga di mayor i've never really heard of that league to be honest and because of that you'll probably end up going for 700 to 750 coins so if you like building colombian squads you'll be able to get yourself a bargain this dude's gonna drop in price he's still got good stats don't get me wrong 
We have our second keeper in this video and that is Pantillamon. He's transferred from Sunderland to Watford. Very tall as you can see there, 6 foot 8. And every time I seem to play against him, he seems to just be really good. I don't know what it is. And finally for you guys who like to use bronze players, bronze card, things in that region, we have Reese Turner. Now I actually used his old card, his Oldham card in a bronze squad I made. If you want to watch that, you know what? I'll link it down in the description. Anyways, that is it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Took me a lot of time to actually find some of these players. Nevertheless, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like as that would be very much appreciated. Down in the comments, let me know what player I missed out on, what players I should have added into this video. And for today, that's about it from me this is t-max signing out thanks for watching guys and see ya <laughs> this is the end of the video hi yeah. if you enjoy just comment and subscribe want to see more don't forget to leave a like do it <laughs> this is t-max signing out